Uh, as you know, my name is Andrew Boulay, and today I'm here to present you my presentation about how to learn different languages. So, uh, as I see in our group, there is uh, many people from Asia, so I think you have very wonderful opportunity to learn many new languages here because you are in Europe. And thanks to the things which we call Schengen, you can without passport travel to at least, I think, 29 countries. And you can learn them many, many languages. In Europe, basically, there are three link basic linguistic groups. It's uh, Romance, Germanic, and Slavic. Uh, actually, I don't know why Slavic always get red, so I actually cover my account with yellow, so you can actually better see where I am coming from and uh, actually well, where I am coming from. And, uh, it's very hardcore language. Um, so we will have now a minute of tour. We will be completely honest to ourselves and, we'll, and we will ask ourselves how high are our chances to learn new language. I try to look over the internet on this answer and I have found a very nice uh, video presentation of TED.com. It's about um, how newborn babies, uh, toddlers, use their brain and which part of brain is uh, to learn a mother tongue. And there was a very nice graph which showed what our chances to learn the language are. And I see that everybody in this group is not in this graph. Because actually, well, it is, but our chances, I see, you know, what, how high they are. We are like <laughs> But fortunately, I came here today with two methods how to learn different languages. First one is TWT, and second one is ABW. Okay, what these shortcuts means? TWT mean water throwing method. Um, it's a method how you actually I will ask you how you can learn swimming. Well, I think there is only one option, one option, and it's to throw somebody to water, and he <laughs> have only two possible opportunities. He can actually two possible options. Uh, he can learn to swim or he can drown himself. <laughs> so, and I have to say, we are now in a country which don't give a chance to use this method because everybody here uh, speak English. But if you would go to, for example, to Spain or to Italy, I can guarantee you, you would really use this method. It's basically used on learning by doing it. If you go to the police station or if you go to municipality, you want to register in office. These people in Netherlands speak English, but in Spain or Italy or in France, they really hate English. They, they don't speak. So you have to learn their language immediately and instantly by doing it and you can use it. Uh, thank God, we live in 21st century, so we have now even more possibility, technical technology and possibility, technical possibilities, how to use technology to learn instantly. I think this is one of the first programs which will come in the future, and especially this one is just translating uh, from Spanish to English and from English to Spanish, and I think this is very good because you can easily and instantly learn new uh, words. Just, just looking over the words. It's available now. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> the second method, and the last method I will present to you today, is alcohol beer wine method. And I am very proud I actually developed it by myself. And it's basically based on consumption of alcohol. If you want to learn new language, 
I think you have uh, two obstacles in front of you. First one is you don't have an appropriate vocabulary. You don't know the all words you need to use. And the second one is that you are very shy to use it in daily conversation. You can obey these obstacles by using these methods. Uh, morning, when you wake up, just a little bit drink or very strong alcohol, for example, vodka or uh, I don't know, something else. And you have a good mood from start. You come to somebody who happened and you say, Makalak. I like I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> uh, in noon, uh, you need to uh, have a good mood, so you drink a little bit of beer, and basic, basic. Uh, one of the side effects is you don't uh, you don't have a hunger, and in the evening you want to socialize yourself. You drink a little bit of wine, and. The one of the side effects is when you consumption wine. Uh, when you are consuming consumption, when you are drinking a lot of wine, you live longer. Okay, and of course it has even another side effect. If you use this method very often, I can guarantee you in one month you can get, uh, you can become an alcoholic. Be very uh, aware of this.